All right, what is going on, everybody? Super Saiyan Paul here, back at it once again. I am here wearing some weird ass goggles with Daxter in the Jack 3 HD Collection Let's Play. So, last time we met up with Ashlyn out there at the Oasis where the Dark Maker alien ship type of thing was at. Today, we're back over here at Spargus, so we have a new objective. So, we're gonna back it up and head in here and fuck this vehicle. Heading into one of my personal favorites, the Dune Hopper. It would seem we have something else waiting for us out there in the area over there, wherever the temple is. So we got a little new gadget from, from Ashlyn, our jet board, as well as the Seal of Mar. Now, they did look like they had the option to give me to go over here before we went to Ashlyn, but we need the Seal of Mar for something important in this particular area so we're gonna rush across the wasteland right now the vast vast desert he should have jumped over that pool of water i don't know why i didn't these damn marauders aka angry salty gladiators that i've destroyed probably destroyed their families in the arena all right can we hop this building can we hop this building come on damn it no turbos turbotastic Look at this old, destroyed, ancient village. This is what I kind of wished for the for more of the desert. I wanted like having more villages out here, more people, but no, it's just a small section out here. And that's one of the things that I kind of um made me kind of sad because in Haven City, yeah, we get some new things in this game, but they also took out like one of the main areas, the palace. I don't know if they need more memory, so they basically. Took that chunk out of the game and put it put in this chunk. Because we got a new palace here. Don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off, don't fall off. Oh. Does it send me back to the spawn in Spargus or does it send me towards where I'm headed? Checkpoints in this game are nice but weird and I don't really know. And Jack 2 it was a lot more unpredictable. But it's whatever. And we have three turbos but I'm not going to use them because I might fly right off of this but we'll see if they're still in my vehicle or if people steal this shit while I'm gone inside this temple I might have had to almost use the turbo there you guys saw that jump if I flip this vehicle into an angle where I'm point pointing the, the turbines downwards I can actually fly so it's cool alright let's head all the way up here Whoa! There we go. See that? That's all like. Might have flew into a precursor by accident. It's cool. And that's how you park. See that? That's how you park. All right, headed back into this this weird ass temple of death that, that Jack likes exploring so much. Don't need that anymore. Don't need that. Yeah, we could have just spammed everything in here. Oh, we got metalheads now. Metalheads have infiltrated the building. And I didn't even really get anything to use Dark Jack on. This reflex beam really takes away from everything. Look at that. Completely eviscerated. Give me the gem. Give me a ring. Give me a ring. It's actually harder to get the gems than it is to kill those guys. 94. More dark power that I don't get to use. Alright, we're in this room. That's the path we took last time, right? Right? Now we're getting somewhere. That's the ticket. So we couldn't have gotten in here, even though they were giving us a beacon in the last episode. So I went through this path last time. I'm pretty sure I went to the right, though. I'm going to have to look that over. I could have sworn. But it's cool. This is a completely different path. How Metalhead's gotten here, I don't know. They're pissed. They're all trying to find a new place to relocate to.
Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Okay. We're good. I must be very careful. And we couldn't also do this without the jet board. So light and dark. The balance. I have to do this little obstacle course in here. This place has been flooded. Ooh, it's a jet board tutorial. Yeah, we got a new buffed up jumping ability here. All right, now that we got all those, let's head through here. Don't need to be on the jet board for some of these. Stop telling me what to do, game. I know what I'm doing. Alright, we gotta grind. Nine. This place is falling apart. This is death. This is death. We didn't have death in the original jet board course. Oh wow, I had to jump for that one? Come on, man. Come on, man. First triangle. That's something new that they had to do. Flip right around, which is really, really useful when on the jet board. Adds some more control to this thing. Alright, five more. Four more. Don't tell me to get on the jet board. I missed. No! Oh. My god. Thank you, checkpoints. Thank you. Fell in there by accident. Alright, where did I miss one? How did I miss one? See, dying really screws you up here. Where is it at? I'm gonna look over this recording and everyone's gonna be like, Paul, you idiot. Wait, was it through here? Let me just scan. Oh, here it is. Nice, nice. Now, gonna head to the end of this hallway. This new light and dark jack door has been opened. Here we go. Launch. Jump. Come on. Come on. Ouch. Alright, let's try this again. I'm gonna launch jump and I'm gonna fucking just jump off the thing. Was I gonna make that? Uh. Oh wow, I did. I'll take Metalhead Gems any day. It's the other thing I don't want. Light Eco Well. Aha. Too bad I took no damage. All right. Headed through here. Look at those platforms. We meet again, Great Warrior. But sadly, your coming may be too late. You will soon meet the seed of our downfall. It approaches quickly, and I fear we no longer have the power to resist. Behold the pure power of light. We offer what little we have in this dire moment. It would have been cooler if like I had Super Saiyan eyes where you couldn't see anything. Light flash freeze. And the cool thing is my hopes were reinvigorated because now I get to stay in the form rather than just disappear. And look at this. Everything's in slow motion. But you can change out of it. Oh god, precursor orbs. So plentiful in this room. Let's not mess with them. But yeah. Anyway. 
Unlimited power. All right, I can't even roll while in this mode. All right, all the platforms just flipped. Don't kill me. Oh God. And we made it to the end. Nice, nice. The thing I liked about this game as well is that after most of these missions, you get something out of it. Whether it be new armor, new powers, new unlocks. There's so many things to unlock. After every mission, you're getting something new. And no light jack on the board. Oh, thank you for killing me. We turned Daxter into a pancake. All right, let's try this again. Not the best when it comes to using the jet board and platforming. Getting points? Yes. Platforming? No. Doesn't have the best controls when it comes to that. Oh, I barely made that. The camera tried to trick me or help me slowly. All right, we got these new windmills, windmills of death or something. These platforms trying to kill me out here. Funny, they put a light eco well knowing that I'd have to do some ninja stuff. God damn it. I thought I could run on the side. This is one of the coolest things I always saw because like, since it's moving so fast, right? Basically in light jack, I'm moving at the speed of a Saiyan. Don't touch these blades, by the way. Yeah, I'm moving so fast. I wish they would show you like a replay of what you just did in real time. Speed of a Satan. Now, let me keep some of this power because it takes a lot of Jack's energy to... Really? Really? He died like that? Where the hell did it put... Okay. Love the checkpoints. Oh, come on! Since we're killing both us and Daxter, it doesn't really work. But yeah, it takes out half of my, my, my energy. Not dying here again. I'm surprised you can't run on the sides properly. And, and why are my goggles following me? I always wondered that. Like, that little trail that I'm leaving. By clapping my hands, I can stop time. That's how powerful he is. Who do you guys think would win in a fight? Light Jack or Dark Jack? Giant Dark Jack versus this. Well, it's not really fair to say because I don't have all the powers yet, so... We'll, we'll bring up the debate later on. Oh, and isn't this where Paul screwed up for your first time? One of the coolest moments in this game. Wow, two light bulbs. In this same temple, I grabbed... One precursor orb and ruined everything. Here we go. We're moving so fast. We're destroying this little obstacle here. Where the rocks are falling. Look at that. Epicness. Oh yeah, here we go. Badass cruiser right here. Finally, technology after so long. Tired of the desert, tired. It looks just like the catacombs we saw in Haven City, but where do they go? There you are. Ah, oh, I'm so squawking happy I found you. Look, Jack got his seal back and it opens doors. Onan says we must get back to Haven City. She says the catacombs are the key to the planet's very survival. You boys up for a little ride? Yeah, boys. How the hell did you find us here? How the hell did you even get in here? Did you come in here from Haven through here? I mean, you can fly, so what's the point? All right, here we go. Very, very cool, fast-paced section right here. If you just keep firing, you should be good when it comes to anything blocking away or destroying this guy thing. Just don't fall off. Oh, 
Oh my god. It's insane. Going through to the ceiling. You can easily fall through one of these holes and die. Like you don't see them coming, but I don't know how I made it through here. What the hell? Nice. You show promise, but your bravery will not protect you from the foes you must soon face. Use this light power to help in your quest. It is what little we have left to offer. Two new light powers back to back. Yeah. Look at him. His eyes are white and everything. All right. That's the exit. So I'm guessing he flew through here since he knows where he's going. But same time, look at that. So new abilities back to back. That's awesome.